Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome back to West of Loathing. Now that I got my mind's eye opened, I figure it's time to go to Madness Maw Mind and figure out what the hell's happening over there because, whoa! Starts making a bleeper. It's not an encounter. Involuntary risk taking is rewarded when you find a high-tech crate. Okay! Ooh! Ooh! I got punch cards! I don't know what that means, but I got them. I got one of those before, but I'm not under- uh. Hi! How's it going there, friendo? How you doing? What's up here, partner? Uh-oh. A mind that is not only guarded, but guarded by cultists. Uh-oh is right. Thinking of getting to the bottom of this. All right, sure. You aren't one of us. Be gone from this place, interloper! Now you know something bad is going down. Nobody good uses the word interloper. I'm gonna hornswoggle ya! If you know what I mean. Chill, chill. I just don't have my mask on. I forgot it here after the last time. Oh yeah, where's your proof? Proof that I left it here? Well, I'm not wearing it, am I? Which I obviously would be if I had it on me. Uh, come on, let me in. I don't want to miss the thing. All right, fine, but don't forget your mask this time. Alrighty then, well that worked out mawfully well. Mawfully well. It worked out mawfully well. I'm gonna get foraging so I can get this goddamn loco weed. Got it. Nailed it. Ooh, green thumb. Yay! Yay! I got a green thumb now. I don't know. Oh, hi. Hello, cultists. Hello. Hello there, fellow cultists. What? Go away. That's not very friendly. This isn't a knitting circle. Where's your mask, anyway? I forgot it. Somewhere. Hello. What happened to your mask? I modified it. It made drinking difficult. What happened to your mask? Uh, I'll be right back. See ya. See ya. Hello. How it's up? I got some rocks. Yeah? The master gave them to me. He wanted me to have them. Okay, what's cool about them? They're mine. Don't touch them. All right, fine then. Ah, you seem kind of injured. I fell down, but Master picked me back up. That's nice. He'll pick us all back up. He'll pick you back up. Sounded like a threat when he said it like that. How's it going? New mask. Who dis? Uh. Okay. See. I see ya. Gotta find. Well, that's a nice mask. Hi. Right, why is your mask different? Because I'm the leader of this cell. How can you be down here and not know that? Look, I passed seven different guys to get here. Obviously, if I weren't meant to be here, that would be impossible. <laughs> I suppose? So who's this master everyone's talking about? Our great dark master, Roberto. Are you sure you're supposed to be down here? Uh, sure, sure, it's fine. It's fine, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, man. Hi, how's it? Shh, I'm listening. To what? Master, of course. Can't you hear him? Uh, yeah. Sure, sure can. I sure can. So, I remember these spirals in another mine. It says, Dear Jeff, the big guy says to stay out of here. Praise be Roberto, sincerely. Jeff. My name is Jeff. Whose name is you? A vibrato response bonder goes crazy when you go near these rocks. Okay, well, there's a ladder there. Let's go down. Okay. Chano. Cha cha chano. There are four buttons. Some fuck row. <laughs> Some zabbun and vaknik. El machine. <laughs> the machine. Uh, so you stick him in the slot, but something happens. I don't know what's going on. Sure. Okay. Why not? Big cylinder. I got an El Vibrato cylinder. Alright. Bunch of paper cards. Alright. Alright. And then a bunch of rocks. Alright. I don't know what's going on here, but I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna go to the buffalo pile. Phew, it's crazy hot out here. The desert's the worst. You could end up like one of those charred black skeletons clacking towards you. I'll fight him. I'll give him a little fight. Let's shoot nanny it up. Hey! Hit some of them. You hit none of them, you goddamn asshole. All right, fine. We're gonna, mm, we're gonna finish you off. Get carried. Ow. Hot. Ah, it boins my skin. Bang. Well, that's not enough. You finish off that one. Damn it, Gary. Why you gotta be better than me? Bang! If my shooting nanny would have hit one of them, it would have been better. Got a gold tooth, though, so that's good. I can give it to that lady. Whoa! Okay! That's a lot of bones! That's a lot of bones! That is. That's a lot of bones. It's a lot of bones. Wow, wow, wow. What is? It appears to be a giant pile of buffalo skeletons. Why? I don't know. I guess it beats leaving them strewn all over everywhere. That is... That's a lot of bones. That's a lot of bones. Okay, alright. Buffalo, buffalo. Buffalo, 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 buffalo. 
Wow. All right. Well, this seems culty. I mean, I'm not just gonna be, be calling names here, but this seems pretty culty. Duck size skeleton, gross. Duck size hippopotamus, gross. Cruise, fairy, pustulant stalker. All right. Well, there's a lot of those. Hear a lot of activity down that corridor. Chanting, shuffling of robes, scattering of bones, scary stuff. You really shouldn't go down there. All right. Okay. All right. What's down here? Ah! Oh! <laughs> it's covered in big beakers. I got an oversized chemical beaker. It's gallon size. All right. Cool. All right. Blood. <laughs> Great. Blood. You have no idea what you're trying to make here. You sure you want to mess with this stuff? Yeah, I am. Give it up, me. Open up the blood faucet and fill the beaker up halfway. Milk. Less threatening than the blood. Let's go with the milk. All right. Partially fill. Icker. Gets. Give me some of that icker. Let's watch this shit. Steam rises from the beaker as the in reaction intensifies. The intense heat of the reaction fuses the acre spigot into a useless mass of metal. How will it end? The boiling <laughs> subsides and what's left in the beaker is- Yes! Tell me! Tell me! <laughs> when the reaction subsides, you're left with a beaker of revolting black fluid. And what's even worse is that it's useless revolting black fluid. You pour it down the floor drain before it can disappoint you any further. <laughs> and then discard the beaker. Take that, black fluid! Ha! Showed you what's up. Wait. Hang on. Wait. Oh, god damn it. I just came from that corridor, didn't I? Wait, I want to go back. Oh, I want to go back. Wait. Oh, through the bars, hundreds of buffalo human skeleton hybrids. I wanted to make milk, milk, lemonade round the corner fudge is made. That's what I wanted to do. I forgot about that. <laughs> milk, milk, lemonade! That's what I wanted to do. God damn it. I would have made fudge. I know it would have made fudge. It would have. I guarantee. Flush. It's good toilet. Ugh. They really should use scented candles. Yeah, sure. Tell them that when you find them. Alright, wait. Oh. Got a discipline slip. What's that? Looks like one of the necromancer cultists got written up. Two more of these and they'll be ritually eviscerated. Nothing personal. It's just corporate policy. All right, fine then. Well, that's weird. All right, bones rule, do they? All right, okay. Ooh, bottle of buffalo <laughs> tranquilizers. I got a black hood! All right! Cool! All right, is that gonna help me blend in? Hide in it? You settle in among the thick black robes. It's pretty comfortable. Wait. You wait and wait. You finally hear some noises outside as a couple cultists pass through on their way from somewhere else. You don't catch much of what they say, but what you do hear is Acre after blood. Way to go, stud. Why is Dr Doug having so much trouble with this? Wait some more. Acre after blood, you say? Wait some more. You wait a while longer and the cult is passed through again. This time you overhear something different. No, remember the rhyme. Milk after blood. Rituals a dud. Hmm. Milk after blood. Rituals a, a dud. Acre after blood. Okay. Acre after blood. Way to go, stud. Milk, it's milk before blood, ritual is good. Doug, why can't you get this? Probably because it doesn't rhyme. Okay, so it's milk, blood, icker. Milk, blood, icker. That's what it does. That's how it go. No, no, Doug, that's not it. Remember, blood for milk is as obsolete as the word thilk. That's a kind of a stretch. So it's milk, blood, milk, blood, icker. Got it. Blood before Icar, start that soldier's ticker. Oh, fundamentals of next Mex. Gives you the raised skeletal buddy. Uh, that sounds bad. Why would I do that? Oh, do I have enough to lock picking? Oh, no, I don't. Okay, fine. Ah, I'm back here. All right. So, wait. Yeah, I really want to make. I want to see if milk, milk, lemonade. Milk, milk, lemonade. What's the reaction? Steam caused the lemonade faucet to get clogged up. How will it end? The boiling subsides. What's left in the beaker is... FUDGE! <laughs> what?! That's... That's so good! That's so good! 23! 23! Give me that fudge! You dump the entire beaker of fudge in your mouth and revel in it! Fudge mental! Oh my god! That's amazing! Milk, milk, lemonade, milk! Okay, hang on, wait, 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 we get another beaker. Milk, blood, ichor. Fuse shut, wait, what? No. Wait. No. Wait, no. 
Wait, why is it clogged up? Why is it fused shut? No! Milk blood anchor! Ah! Did I goof it? I goofed it, didn't I? I goofed it real bad. Oh, no! At least I got my fudge. That's what I can be happy about. Ah, fine. What's down here then? In slab alone. Just, just, just let some out. Let's do it. Let's do it. What, what's going on here? Whoa, whoa. Those are scary. Oh, they get, they're tough too. All right, well, I'm going to put this in my body. All right, I'm going to shoot him. Bang! Bitch! Bang! Gary, okay, good. Bang. Bang. Wumpage. All right, you going to get shot? Mm, I doubt you'll be affected. I'm going to shoot you. You going to get wumped? Yeah, Gary got him. Oh, well, Gary did. All right. Bang! 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 How much health that guy thing got? Can I shoot that guy? Do I gotta go in mono e mono? Ray Romano? Alright, fine. I'm going in manual. God damn it. Why didn't I stick with being a goddamn cow puncher? Why am I not a bean slinger? That's my question. Oh, wait. It's just a farming thing. Alright, fine then. How do I clean the goddamn thing? I, I know I gotta do that. Ah, reading material. Ooh, ooh, snake oiler. Yes, that's me. Ooh, I can get good medicine, lets you recover HP and con, uh, big spleen, more potions in a day, expert poisoner. Ooh. I'll take big spleen. That sounds good. I like my spleen. Your chemical experimentations have given you a comically oversized spleen. Trust me, if you could see it, you'd laugh. You, then you sneeze so hard, the magazine is blown completely to bits. Kazunai! <laughs> <laughs> oh, frick, dude. That's real funny. That's real funny. Alright, so how do I clean this shit? There's no way to clean it. What if I just mess up everything and I accidentally, like... What if I- what if I just absolutely bungle up everything? Alright, here we go. Uh, disgusting tainted blood. Alright, what about milk, milk, milk? We're just gonna go super milk. I don't know how this is gonna ruin it, but let's ruin it then. Melt it for some reason. <laughs> Surprisingly, after the reaction concludes, you're left with a big beaker full of milk. <laughs> That's pretty anticlimactic. And now all these are fused shut. Well, what? Good golly gosh, is that gonna do me? How do I clean that? All right, fine. You know what? I'm gonna get out of there. I'll come back later. All right, I gotta go. Oh, yeah, I gotta go to the desert house. I forgot. I know there's a shifting gears right now, but I gotta go back to the desert house and see. Oh, cheap wine. All right, well, that's good. But anyway, not worried about that. I gotta go back to the desert house and see if, um, if I oil up this thing, maybe I can do something about it besides killing them all. That'd be nice. Because I really don't know how to get this all done. Oil the hinges! Oil them! You use last of the oil in the can on the rusty hinges. The gates swim open easily and silently. Nice. Alright. You creep up to the door. You can hear the gang inside. You notice the door jam is busted, probably from being kicked in. There's a crude hasp made of bent nails. Looks like the bandits have been just been locking it with a padlock from the outside when they leave. If you had a lock, you could turn this fortress into a prison. Wait, I had! Didn't I have a lock? Hey, let me go to Dirtwather. I know there was a lock available somewhere. Who wants to fight? Well, you're dead, bang. Who wants to fight? Nobody, you're dead. Alright, so if I go in here... I know there's someone that's selling a lock, and if I get a lock on that bud boy, what's it gonna do for me? Not you, you scuzz! Was it you, Button Willow? Was it you, Button Willow? Corpse of the cowboy. Oh, proper burial. All right, what do you got? You got a lock? No! Where's your goddamn- where? I know there was a lock. All right, I'll come back to that. Okay, I gotta go to Curious Cops. Uh, open it. Handful of nails, ranch punch, great. All right, we're going to Curious Cops. I don't even know- whoa. A lot of trees here. Looking at all these trees! You'd have to, there's nothing else to look at it. And yet a bee leaping box shooting to bring us here? Let's scout ahead a bit. Oh. Ooh, El Vibrato. Alright, sneaking on my belly just to make sure no trees sneak up on me. Whoa, hello. Shockweed plant. Got shockweed extract. Alright, sure, why not? Ooh, hello! Thing looks pretty tough and pretty attentive. Alright, alright, not that tough. God, I'm gonna one-shot this bad boy, watch this. A boom! A bangy! Alright, fine, man. You're dead now. 
So what good with that? Ooh, deafening. Whoa! Yay! Jumping for ju Wow, that's a big teleporter. Machine is not switched on, but it has an empty coffee cup. Confounded contraption is dark and silent. The monolith is dark. Interesting. That's a big ass teleporter. That is that is a big teleporter. Like a big, way big. Way big teleporter. I gotta go back to the professor eventually, but let me hit this military cemetery. Ooh. Crack of a rifle. A lead bee buzzes past your ear. I call bullets lead bees sometimes. <laughs> ah, let's fight him. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. I just die. Okay, well, then that was fun. Antique range fighter. Ah, nice. But I don't want that. I want my thing. I want my thing. Is my third eye still open, by the way? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. All right. Military simile. Oh, military. Oh, no, that is embarrassing. All right. It's your partner. Look, through a gate, many of stone crosses. Those are graves. I guess military graves, since they're all the same and in such neat rows. Soldiers? Yeah, even when they're dead, the officers make them line up in formation. Uh, funny. All right, there's a shovel. I don't need another shovel. You poke around in the shed. The caretaker appears to have been shirking his duties for quite a while, judging by the dust and cobwebs. Look at the tools. All right, shovel under the chair. All right, scope out the desk. All right, tiny paint jars. All right. Flyers! Uh, Ford Memoriam! Ah! Okay, well, alright then. Eternal Flame! Wow. There's an Eternal Flame here. Is this a burning of Eternal Flame? I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to do that. No, it's good fire. Not to wasting it. Let Gary handle this. Gary ambles over and chats with the goblin. Alright. Hey, they asking if wanting buy a weenie. Alright, sure, I'll buy a weenie. Oh, I don't want to trade off my moxie for that. No thanks. No thanks, bucko. No thanks, buckaroo. Buckery bear. Get out of here with your stupid. Oh, wow. You can visit an individual plot number. I need to visit 420. That's right. Blaze it. Ooh. Okay. Stop looting graves. That, you know, for one day. I'll stop for now. Pass and fair mycologist. Ah, mush. After you'd finished reading the book, you absentmindedly misplace it while musing about mushrooms. Drat. I'm so stupid. Alright, now that we did that, I think I need to go back to Ghostwood because I- I didn't finish this- Oh! Eh, alright, I'll shoot you. Let me- hang on, I gotta drink this real quick. Uh, alright, good, okay. Time for bangs. Bang! Okay, well, see ya. Intimidating six gun. I don't need that. If I was still a cow puncher, that might be good for me. Hey, need a drink, please. Beer, please. Fumperdank, Mumfler, but now my middle name is Sneaky. It's Sneaky. I'll buy it. Got a bottle of ghost beer. It's cold. All right, well, I got that. Why, why else did I have that? I forgot why I needed a beer. Was there anything else? I've completely forgotten. I guess that was it. I just came for a bottle of ghost beer. That was literally it. Well, that was fun. <laughs> Let me go back to Breadwood, see if I can solve some of their problems. Ooh, curious abandoned well. Damned well stopped to investigate it. All right. Ah, peculiar. Hearing a tiny sound, like a distant high-pitched humming? Me too. Aha, a well, a well of sounds where water is not. Doesn't seem to be coming down there. The transponder goes ape. All right, well, I'll go down. Oh, look at you. Look at you. Where am I going now? Apparently nowhere, because everything's dead. Alright, well, don't know where this is taking me. Ooh! Oh, vibrato chamber. Habuno stakuzmzum! No buttons. Put in large punch card. Okay. Oh! Whoa! Put in punch card! Oh! Yeah! Put in punch card! Oh! Yeah! Okay, cool. Wow. But I'm learning words! That's good. Ooh, I had a lot of these punch cards. Okay, well, I've learned a lot of things. Habuno terminal. All right then, well, I, I there's a Habuno terminal. Huh, it's amazing that these teleporters still have power to them, but nothing else seems it does. All right, well, that's good. A little bit of a detour on the way back to Breadwood, so let's keep on going. Well, time to shoot somebody. Yeah, I'm gonna shoot you, bang. Okay, you're dead now. Thank you, vibrating scapula. Scapula. All right, thank you. Redwood. Hey, I took care of your mail problem. What? 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 
Ah, all right. Well, I'll take care of all your problems then. All right, let me just look at all your problems. The logging permit. We're running out of trees around here. Well, that's not good for my bridge. The town died. Okay, I guess I'll check that out. Oh, that's why I need to go to the dead ghost wood. Ah, okay. Well, let me just get all of his problems lined up and that way I can just freaking do the thing yet. Uh, soup shortage. Sure. Well, bread wood, bread bowl, so soup stock load. Great. That's where I wanted to go. Skeleton raids, that's bad. Two more. All right, old schmutz brewery. Do I really gotta solve all your damn problems, old man? All right, last one, missing bread. I got all of it, Baker Boys. Sure thing. All right, we're going to Alexandria Ranch first. And then we're gonna go the rest of the way. Open it up. Good. Sweet. Ah! Hello! Cow's hearing us. I'm pretty sure the cows can see us, let alone hear us. All right, let's fight him. Got to jump on him this time. Oh, these guys ain't gonna get nothing. They'll shoot him up! Shoot him, Marie! Oh, <laughs> and you're dead. I'm so sorry about that, cows. But it's too late for you. Time for you to go home. Wow, this place has really been blown to pieces. All right, Diary of Alexandria Alexandria. That was a cool name. Ooh. You flip through the diary, most of it is uneventful, describing the life of a woman who likes books and isn't interested in much else. It ends with a passage about a soldier from a nearby fort warning her about some kind of danger he wouldn't specify, so she moved most of her valuable books to the cellar. It took the ordinary precautions, boarding up the windows and not leaving the house at night. Turns out that isn't much good against Cannonball. <laughs> oh, Jesus, hilarious. All right, overdue breadwood book. Well, found that one. 12.5% of total stock. Oh, modern snake oiler. Thank you. I needed that one. All right. Bad medicine. Quick on the draw. Increases your speed. Expert poisoner. I'll do quick on the draw. That sounds good. All right. Hell yeah. Oh, I didn't even read how I lost that one. Uh, it was probably going to make me mad. Make me laugh, but whatever. All right. You pick up the cannonball and inspect it. There's an inscription that you can mostly read. It says the cannonball came from Fort Treason and it's address stamped right on the surface. This bombardment was done by the army at Fort Treason. Well, that sounds bad. How do I open this goddamn cellar? Well, hopefully she's there. All right. Well, I got that. So let me go over to Fort Treason and see if I can get some answers out of these assholes. Oh, shut up. You bam. All right, you're dead. All right. I'm really, I'm really tough. That, that like, uh, that, that potion, that really did it in for me. Four mans. They do not answer it. Yes, to scavenge. All right, let's go scavenge. Oh, you look at the cannon. It's a fine cannon. Demi culverin in size. Insert your cannonball. You look through the range finder on the cannon, but you can't see any indication of anything you want to shoot at. You decide not to waste the ball. All right, whatever with your wastefulness. Jeez, coward. All right, what do we got? Every soldier man is gone. Poke around, see if I can find something. What do we got here? All right, sugar guns, eye candy. Okay, all right. Lock picking, all right. Kick open. All right. Military school class ring. Ooh, that's a lot of pistol damage. All right. Good stuff. That's a lot of silver bullets. Oh, Private Matthew's diary. All right. What do we got there? Wait, where'd that go? Oh, there it is. Okay. Most of Private Mathaw's diaries empty plages, ink sprot, latrine duty, stuck out in the middle of nowhere. Captain eventually decided a nearby ranch was actually an enemy spy outpost. Felt compelled to warn the woman. Oh. Uh, okay. Place doesn't have any damn shore. What the hell? Shore leaving dirt water. Weird. Declares his intention to start a mutiny, but the diary ends with no conclusion to the story. Interesting. Private Lemon's diary. All right. Private Lemon's diary is pretty dry and not very interesting. Day-to-day -day duties. Si Captain Simon becoming increasingly agitated and convinced that a nearby ranch is being used as a spy outpost. Lemon doesn't sound convinced, but honor orders are orders. Descend in the ranks, possible mutiny, rest of the pages are blank. Was there anybody else's? No, but I got this. Where did that come from? All right, I'll do expert poisoner. Nice. Oh, when you apply poison, you apply three times that much. Unfortunately, you get so distracted about thinking the new kinds of poison that you misplace the magazine. Ah, boring. I should probably change out for one of these rings. All right, this is good. I mean, I do love my nasty spittoon ring, but you know, it's a good trade-off, I suppose. Must have been where they stole all the fire. <laughs> ah, funny. Funny stuff, buddy. Funny stuff, buddy poo. All right, let's quickly go over to the old Schmaltz Bull Brewery. Jump in and see. Oh, nice. Okay. 
What's over here? Schmaltz? What's here, buddy? A smell? What is it? A brewery? Do goblins have beer? Beer? Oh, booze! We do fermenting a special cactus juice. Is it good? Can't ever remembering. Okay. Right. Okay, well, I'm gonna be right back. <laughs> see you, see you, guy. Oh, have fun with that. I'm gonna get a floral ring. Hmm. That's right. Makes foraging random encounters much more likely. Oh, that's so nice. Ah, uh, okay. All right. Now to see what this is. Yep, that's fucking terrifying. Okay, now I'm gonna just, uh... All right, here we go. Let's see what- Hey, how's it going? Fella's too scared to talk to you. Just totally freaked out about the yeast. Beer hose. You're not really sure what purpose it must have served. All right. Well, sample these contents. <laughs> It's almost pure ethanol. Blarg. Oh, dead guy's hat got knocked off. It's covered with yeast. Okay, the yeast go. Okay, but ew. Great. Ah, uh, this is a great hat to wear if you and your loved ones absolutely love the smell of dough. Or if you don't mind it and your enemies hate it, I guess. Alrighty then. Well, the yeast beast seems to have killed this guy pretty thoroughly. Some kind of crazy yeast monster has apparently broken loose from the vats and eaten some of the bandits. I guess they brewed up something they couldn't put down. They could barley control it. You'll have to hop to it if you want to prevail. All right, fine then. All right, we got the jump on him, big boy! We got the jump on him, baby! All right. Kabam! And then boom! Oh shit, dude. All right, well. Ow! Bang! Dead. I should have gotten the hard hat. This is pretty easy. All right, the remains of the horrible beast. I guess you could take some back to the mayor. It's probably still good, right? I got, I got, blob a big old glob of yeast in your back. <laughs> Just right in the backpack, no container, half a ton of yeast. Great. So this whole yeast theft biz doesn't seem to have gone too well for you boys. Yeah, I, oh geez, are you bounty hunter? Relax, the mayor just wants his yeast back. He didn't say anything about hauling you in. Uh, at least, okay, well, the yeast is in that revolting pile. What happened? Well, we got bored of bread is all. I know a bit about brewing and we figured if we came back with a couple kegs, nobody would mind if we stole that yeast. No offense, but it seems like you are much of a brewer. Hey. Well, ideally, you wouldn't end up with a ravenous yeast monster. Wasn't my- okay, it was my fault. I understand what happens. The vats are old and we didn't clean them properly first. I think there were some frogs living in one of them. And you figured you could use the extra hops? Ha ha. Ha. If you're sure you figured it, got it figured out. You could set up shop in dirt water. Oh. Yeah, it's turning into quite a little metropolis. I'd love to have my own place. I'll go check it out. All right. Three cans of beer. Can of schmaltz blue ribbon. All right. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of extra damage. I don't know if I can imbibe that. I think I'm pretty full, but maybe. Actually, my liver can take a good bit. I'll drink some of that. Mmm. Mmm. Weak and lukewarm. Great. Fun stuff. Good stuff. Glad I did that. Beer hose. <laughs> All right, hey, it's too grumpy to talk to you. Arrest him. You're under arrest! For what, stealing about two handfuls of yeast? Yes. And the sentence for that is what, about three days in jail? Um, and Breadwood does not actually have a jail. All right, I'll let you off with a warning. What about this dead guy? Yep, he's dead. All right, well, that'll do it for this episode. But we're knocking this list off pretty quick. All these problems seem to not be doing too bad for me. So either way, thank you everybody so much for watching. God, I love this game. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!